Right, hi, uh, hello everyone. This is uh, on my 78 UK and this is in the middle of my new uh, man cave, shed build, YouTube studio, whatever you want to call it. Uh, getting there, it's, 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 uh, it's getting there. And that's what's held, holding me up from doing any videos really, um, because I've lost the space that I, I usually made them. That's a bit echoey in here at the moment, but it's gonna need a lot of soundproofing, so the whole place will be soundproofed anyway. This is about 78 RPM records, is it not? I'm not about old shed studios or whatever. So I'm sorry about the really poor quality filming that I'm doing now, but this is just a quick update. And well, I'm gonna, t I'm gonna talk to you about a crate I found. <laughs> just gonna quickly show you a few and just go through uh, what I found in one crate. Right, well, we're just coming through. As you can see, it's a bit of a mess because of a bit of clearance and a bit of things going on. And uh, I have been working very hard, but I've covered, completely covered, all my uh, 78s up, <laughs> almost. They're all behind here, loads of them. The 3,000 plus, I, I would say now. This crate here has been very interesting indeed. And... Uh, I, I come across, oh, I can move them back a bit. I come across a lot of really early 78s here. Um, it's a, the uh, Zonophone uh, record label has quite a few of those, including some really dodgy, unpolitically correct ones. Uh, but uh, yeah, quite a few of early, early stuff here indeed, um, which I'm really dying to listen to. Uh, I've listened to a couple of them, but I've not been able to uh, video them. Um, I've also found, I've, I've been I've placed them in this cupboard. I bought this cupboard the other day, and I thought, this is a nice old cupboard to keep some uh, records on. And that, and I found some really cool jazz records. Uh, the Riverboat Shuffle there with Frankie Trambauer and his orchestra. Um, not as early, as obviously, as uh, the originals, but um, King Porter's Stomp. Harry James and his orchestra. It's a, it's a very, very interesting crate, this. And also, at the back here, there's, I reckon this is uh, a few there's a couple of collections here. And I found these here where uh, they are s envelopes um, that are still sealed with uh, records in. Now, I, th I think these were probably posted to the guy at some point. There is one or two that are open. Uh, there's one there, for instance, that is open in the Columbia label. Um, just, it's very difficult to do this one-handed, but I'm trying my best. Uh, uh, it's the oh, it's the Irish in me, sung by Ruby Murray. Um, but there's a lot of these that haven't been opened. They're, they're whether the collector sealed them himself, I don't know. Why would you seal? Why would you collect records and then seal them into envelopes? Bit, bit of a weird one that but this has been a fantastic find um there's there's a lot of jazz in here there's a lot of jazz on the back here that i found um i'll pull this one out uh ain't misbehaving uh that's a great one um it's a piano version is it not duke ellington and his orchestra uh, baby when you ain't there it, there is a lot of jazz i found jazz on HM, hmv uh kenny cotton's pickers dance orchestra there the way i feel today there's a lot of really 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 cool stuff in here so i just wanted to share that with you right so thanks for watching uh this little update video i hope you now sort of understand why I'm not about as much as I would like to be. Uh, I watch as many of your videos as I can. I mean, I kind of have to pick and choose sometimes because there's quite a few that goes up. Um, uh, but what I have seen has been fantastic, and you guys are well above me uh, on this hobby. Uh, I'm not. I'm not a, 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 a someone who knows a lot about it really. I'm just trying to get into it and enjoying them. That's the main thing. I'm just enjoying them. I've got records in there I've discovered that I cannot find on YouTube, I cannot find on Google, if I Google them, I cannot find them, some of them, um, some of them there's just, there's just nothing uh, being recorded, so I'm looking forward to 
putting things up like that and hopefully you can come back and tell me more about them because I'm actually struggling on some of them to, to, to find stuff about them, to learn about them. So I'm going to leave you guys, if you watch these videos, to come back and tell me more about them as you are the experts. Now, this place, as I say, one day will be the place where I store my gramophone records and my gramophone players and play stuff or put up on YouTube. And I hope you can wait until that day comes. For now, I'll keep on watching and I'll keep on enjoying your videos. Keep on spinning them and I'll catch you again soon. Thanks for watching this.